Hello everybody, it's Volibear and welcome back to some more Life is Strange Before the Storm. I did not forget about this game, but there's episodes that I finally have time to play now. In episode 1, we did that way, way back last year in the summer. So this episode, well, both the last episodes have been out for a while. So we're finally going to get to it after so freaking long. I did not forget about this game, but... It's a good game. Good story based game. So let's go ahead and finally continue this game for once after like seven months. But anyway. Obviously, on Life is Strange Before the Storm. Ooh, hold up. Hold up. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. Ooh. I'm going to teach this little punk some manners. I remember that. Hey, dickhead. Yeah, buddy. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, he snapped. Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm trying to remember on one's name. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? How would you like to join me? Look at little oh, Rachel. Don't be surprised, Chloe, if one day I'm just out of here. Mm. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. You remember that guy that we saw under this tree with that woman? That was my dad. Oh yeah, that gave me and the chills last time. It was definitely not my mom. Jesus Christ. But yeah, anyways. If y'all haven't already, make sure you definitely smickety smash that like button. I'll subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitter. Links in the description below. So, I'm not trying to ruin the mood. But anyway, let's go ahead and get this started. Let's see what we got going on next. Alright. Got principal, um... Miss Price. How I honestly good of forgot you his name. Brown. I'm so sorry we're late. My my shift ran late at the diner, and then just sorry. I remember her mom's name is Joyce. I'm trying to get everything back in my head. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process, and the other is all too familiar with it. If he had a mustache, Blackwell's he'd look like Steve Harvey. It's built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. Mm. When that respect okay. is violated... Reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. Right? I guess. Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Yes, I am, okay. Potato Head. What? Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? No. Uh, don't screw up crap. Uh, is that rhetorical? Are you asking, or is that rhetorical? Disrespectfulness. Crap! <laughs> we agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. All right. We did. Come on, Bowler. Be yourself. In the event that you were unable or Don't unwilling be disrespectful. to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the academy. Uh oh. Despite all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday: insubordinate language, disregarding posted signs about trespassing on the stage. My bad. My bad. It happens. Just trying to have a little fun, you know. Of drug use. What? Allegedly. I didn't see any witnesses. This is not a trial, Miss Price. This is a sentencing. Come on, potato head. Shall I continue? <sighs> uh <laughs> sabotage the academic goals of one of our top students. Victoria Chase. Oh yeah, I remember her. Okay, I'm not Cussing her, I mean, cussing him out would be a bad idea, so she cheated. Academic I, I kind of want to be a savage, though. Homework? Because I thought Blackwell had a zero tolerance policy on plagiarism. Excellent suggestion. Stricter punishment for students who violate Blackwell's code of conduct 
is next on our agenda. For her plagiarism, Miss Chase might have been suspended. Ooh. Chloe, you tried to get someone suspended? Might have. If Mr. Prescott, Nathan Prescott, hadn't spoken to me on Victoria's behalf, and we have witnesses saying Miss Price was also involved in a bullying incident of the same Mr. Prescott. Ooh. The hell I was. I stood up for that little weirdo. All right. I Show did. I suppose that's one interpretation of events. Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. Mm mm mm. Calm Wells reassure mom. Oh yeah, his name's Principal Wells. Calm Wells reassure mom. Ugh, what do I do? What do I do? I mean, our mom. Ugh. Academic mom. Acad. I don't care. Family first, y'all. Mom, you know this is all bullshit, right? Chloe, now is not the time. Huh. That didn't work. <laughs> your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price. We needn't discuss any of it. Bro, chill. We need Before you get wrinkles on no, your forehead. Because oh, you wait. severed your relationship <laughs> with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. What does that mean? It means you forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to. I do it. What? Oh. What? What? Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a Rachel. bad day. Rachel, I no. I needed to blow off some steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. Oh. But I wouldn't listen. See, Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me. But only to keep me safe. <laughs> I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? Of course. Absolutely. Yeah, sure. We're cool. Thank you. I'll make it up to you. I promise. She's our best friend after all. Chloe, is this true? It's true. Totally not true. She really is an amazing actress. Mm, mm, mm. Miss Price. Oh, uh, yeah, fine. Fine, yes. It was her idea, but it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. She stood up Miss for us, Campbell, so we might as well roll with it. Just told me I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure? If she didn't make that decision, I would have easily done it, but you yes. know. Uh, I feel bad, no. Rachel. Ray. She didn't have to do that Let's for us, clear, though. Miss Amber. You're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you or trick her? Yes, I'm sure. Oh, thank God. Mrs. Price, this revelation may color the situation some, but it in no way absolves your daughter. Dang. I understand, Mr. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. Oh my gosh. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. Perfect. So but maybe that was the best option. Trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. Oh man. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of the Tempest. My man, man. Oh. I feel bad now though. Crap. I gotta stand up for her. She she stood up for us. I gotta mm. What? Are you insane? Your discipline is still pending, Miss Price. Ray, she loves that show. Since Come on, don't do that to her. Mr. Amber, think, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. 
Please don't tell me how to run my school. Dang, he's stepping on everybody. Come on, dude. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances. Jesus. Gentle and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. How fitting. I feel bad yes. now, though. I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. That is such... What was that, Miss Price? Chloe is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty Even of blame to go she around. Took the blame Chloe's for us. future at Blackwell will be discussed next, unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. Mm. I'm sorry. I gotta take the blame. I don't care. I feel bad. I gotta take the blame. To succeed and back to all listening to your opponent and choose a related comeback. All right. No way is Rachel missing the play for me. But thanks to her acting skills, I'll have to go down in flames if I want to. See, I gotta this. do this for her. I can't Get do that to her. Out of your ass, Wells. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> you seriously think yesterday was a little Miss Sunshine's idea? Come on. Miss Amber has accepted her responsibility. Accept reality. Don't you have the slightest idea how this works? You don't wake up one morning and decide to be an outlaw. Ooh. You need priors. You need training. Rachel confessed. Are you calling her a liar? You should confess. I confess she can act. I confess to thinking she can act like a motherfucker. Oh, <laughs> oh tell him. Half. Hook, line, and sinker. You don't have to do this. It's okay. No, really? I'm doing it for you. Come on. You do you. How about you don't take credit for my shit? You don't see me claiming I did my homework, do you? Because that's your stupid thing. Chloe, this can't be you. Apologize this instant. Should have dragged a regret bully and ate that. Uh, da, 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 da. Fine. There we go. Mr. Wells, I'm sorry for exposing the flaws in your campus security. This must be very embarrassing for We you. actually did it. I've heard enough. Rachel, you were clearly trying to cover for your classmate. I appreciate the motive, but I appreciate honesty more. Is that understood? Yes, sir. You will not be removed there we go. from the plate. Better, that's so hard, but it screws us. And Miss Price, I came into today's meeting planning to suspend you for the rest of the school. Year oh, damn, chance for reinstatement in the fall. And now, you are expelled. Oof. What? No, I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. God. You may wait outside my office until he arrives. God. That is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. Ray. See, I don't want her to miss her play on, over Chloe. our actions, you know? So we might as well tell the truth and take the blame. She really didn't have to do that. I would have done that in reality I'm anyway. sorry. Nothing to be sorry about. Meet me at the junkyard later? You bet. God. I didn't get the chance to introduce myself. I'm Joyce. Mrs. Price. I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. We really should be going. Nice to meet you. Mm. Mom, I'm I'll see you. In the parking lot. God. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me. Hey, Skip. You know I was supposed to have today off, right? Uh. Sorry that my totally fair and impartial hearing inconvenienced you, man. Dang. I don't really care about any of this shit. Except my secret stash. 
Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. Emergency joint. And where is that at exactly? What is this? Sign that. What is that? Almost. Gosh. At the very last second. Take that cat picture, I guess. Hmm. All right, what else, what else? Get trash the homework. We don't need that garbage. Don't give me that look. Shoot. <laughs> All right, let's look at Trusty that. Trusty keeper of my graffiti pens. You've served, expelled. It's starting to feel real. Mm. I had big plans for adding to this collage. Oh well. Dang, man. We screwed ourselves so badly, but like, uh, Maybe it wasn't a good option? I don't know. Trash that geometry book. Don't need that anymore. What you looking at, man? Just... Shoot, <laughs> he's just awkwardly just staring at us, throw away trash. And there's that. Dang. Is that the secret stash? Jackpot. That's what I'm talking about. Wait. What the hell? Damn it, Justin. Chloe, hey, y'all had to borrow your stash. Desperate times, you know. I promise you'll get it back. Oh, and we're not going to be here next week. Dang. Come on, Justin. Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me. Dang. Uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool? <sighs> okay. But try to make it fast, will you? Man, man, man. I can't believe it. Wait! This gives me... Wait, no, she had blue hair at this time. It, it, it threw me back to um Life is Strange, the first one. What's she about to do? Just write in subordinate wells. God. She does not care anymore. Right. Hey, that's what is the song saying? Drew a big fat middle finger in the middle of the floor. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh man. It's gonna take a while to clean that up. Unless it's permanent. Walking all over the sinks. How's nobody came in here at this point? Jesus. Got a whole water right on. Oh, God. She just completely graffiti the whole entire bathroom. That's Victoria, ain't it? She's gonna come in there and see all that. <laughs> She's like, what the? She didn't know what just happened. Man. I wonder what Rachel's gonna do now, though. She's still able to, do, like, do her play and everything. But we're we're done for. But it's better for us to take the blame, to be honest. I mean, we didn't take the blame. It's better for us to be honest instead of her taking the blame. We could have still been at the school, but hey. It, it, it is what it is. Oh. 
Later, Skip. Later. Man, we're done. There we go, David and Joyce. Looks like David's here. God. Awesome. And this looks like a good point to stop this video, so I'm gonna um pick it up next time for the um next part of this chapter. So well this episode I should say. Anyways, my brothers, if you enjoyed this video, definitely smiggity smash that like button. Also, subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitter. Links in the description below. We will continue this um, really soon next time, and then we'll pick up where we left off. And I have no idea when the next part's going to be uploaded, but it'll be uploaded eventually. Probably a day after this anyways. But yeah, anyways, my brothers, I hope y'all take care, take it easy, and Volo Bear out.